Hello everybody, how are we? My name is Unicorn Pontu. Welcome back to another video. And of course, Chantal uploaded another mukbang right after her two hour, oh good lord, live stream that was just 90% of him playing the keyboard. <laughs> and she has a jumbo grilled shrimp dinner mukbang, which honestly, I'm really jealous of because I love shrimp so much. But also, I did see a bunch of rice in the thumbnail, so yay. But with that being said, let's see what Chantal has to say today, shall we? Hello, foodie beauties. <laughs> well, hello, guys. Hello. I have a spectator cat here waiting for something that you're not going to get. Aw. Okay, so I have for dinner grilled shrimps. Grilled shrimp. Um, the shrimp have like their whole body on. What in the heck? They even, even have the eyes on. <laughs> Gross. Wow, it would be awful if you know you can make a food at home to make it exactly how you like. That would be just just a shame if that were an option. Tahini, and I made a little pickle plate here of cheese, jalapeno, Monterey Jack, and pickles. Bismillah. Yeah, I forgot who said it. I'm so sorry. It was somewhere on the internet where... The, I don't know. They, they speculated that the whole entire, like, breakup stream was just kind of a deflection to try to let people forget about, like, you know, the diabetes and health arc thing. The more that, you know, I'm starting to think about it, and the more videos she posts, the more I'm starting to believe that that's actually the truth. And I'm going to give you a little salad of vegetables. Lemon. Bread. Yeah, and fresh bread is the best. Okay, so let's put some cheese on that, baby. <laughs> and eat. Mmm. Okay, let me take care of this and I'll be back. Maybe like this. The head <laughs> creeps me out. I wonder if she likes shrimp, but she, her, here. Some of her food is shrimp. Okay, anyway, I'll just keep the heads on until I'm ready to eat them. Creeps me out, I don't know why, maybe mature, but whatever. Here's some mabooch, chili and garlic. Okay, tahini sauce. Where's my spoon? Oh. So guys, what's going on? Ah. Gotta have my hot sauce. <laughs> She did actually eat the shrimp. She liked it. Okay, well, just wait till I get the other one out. Mmm. I'm so excited. We've been planning our travel. <sighs> we can't tell you where. We can't tell you exactly when. But like I said, more than likely when it's cooled off. Um, shrimp. So that I can enjoy going outdoors. The salad has green pepper, tomato, onion, cucumber, and all the juice from the vegetable. I'm just getting excited. And I want to say, no matter what size I am, what health condition I'm in. I'm traveling. I did it with Thailand. I mean, barely, <laughs> if you remember the Tuk Tuk incident. And also on top of that, the boat incident, like how she pretty much looked completely defeated and you know, one minor inconvenience away from passing out. And also, um, if you can't talk about it and like you can't tell us where you're going, like why bother bringing it up? Genuinely, who cares? Like, okay, great, love that for you like, when the time comes, but until then, okay. <laughs> Sure, it's more enjoyable if you're in a lot of shape, good shape. But I still had a good time. Like, by the way, my subscriber count has gone up. Oh, yep, I wonder why. Miss Sub for Sub begging people for that 100k plaque and the second that she got it, magically, all of a sudden, with that warning, all of the new subscribers stopped coming in. Isn't that so weird and quirky and unique? I know. Somewhat, so welcome everyone new and a lot of you might not. Yeah, I completely agree. I mean, don't you guys see the new subscribers? They're, they're right behind her. Oh, you can't see them? Oh, let me zoom in. You don't see them sitting on the couch? Me either. Know about our couples channel, Salah and Chantal? The link's in the description. But we did a lot of things on that channel. Oh my gosh, yeah, we went to places. Like, abandoned boat graveyards. And like, abandoned schools. Yeah, we did so many great things. And for somebody in my shape, I did a lot of things in Thailand, which are all on that channel. So it's a similar idea. Wherever we go next, we'll be vlogging and I'll be challenging myself. I would like to get healthier, but like I said, no matter what, I'm going to try to go. This tahini sauce has like cumin. Um, you can also dip the bread inside. They didn't give me any fried eggplant. Hi, Juice. Mama. People are like, why do you call her mama? No idea. Or that thing where people were speculating that she was going to be breeding Julia again. Would not be surprised. I do have to share all my food with you, don't I? <laughs> because you're cute and I love you. So we're getting excited and just, you know, play planning. There's a lot of planning. I'm just excited. <laughs> they gave me a full sugar 7-Up, but like I said, I'm trying to drink. You know, 
if I must. I'm getting used to it. Gonna need more. That's off. I love this cheese. It has jalapeno. I got some vitamins. Multivitamin gummies. Tropical flavor. <laughs> because I need to take them. Yep, this is the completely original, grand, absolutely amazing, breathtaking, show-stopping, absolutely spectacular content everybody is stealing. Oh no, whatever shall the world do. Especially like the doctor said I should be taking vitamin D and B12. This one has everything. Like the 100% daily value. So yeah, I just thought I would have dinner with you guys. This is a clove. Big clove. Mm -mm -mm. As per usual. I didn't know shrimp were this ugly in real life. Like, usually when you get shrimp, it's only this part. <laughs> they look like aliens. Like little aliens with their feet and everything. Oh, no way. Grosses me right out. But they're tasty. Oh, yes, they are sure tasty. Oh, God. We're getting to the point to where she's talking to herself in her own mukbangs. God help us. And yeah, I'm going to be paying attention to the food when we travel. Who doesn't like when they travel? Like, you know? Yeah, I don't think anybody was super concerned about that portion of it, but thank you for showing concern. I guess. I don't know. That's why I get annoyed with people complaining in Cuba about the food. Like, uh, is there a reason why we're bringing Cuba back into this? What does Cuba have anything to do with anything? I, huh? I feel like I'm being gaslit. Am I the only one confused by this? Like, who who said anything about the Cuban food? Like, who cared? Like, that's not the reason why people remember Cuba. I think we all remember what happened in Cuba. For example, like, you have to, like, enjoy the food of where you're going because, oh, it's easy to research, too, what the food is like. I, I'm not that picky. Like, I, like, I really liked the food in Cuba. I didn't mind it. The white people food. Yeah, it's not going to be the best. You're in Cuba. Like, they don't eat that. But the beans, rice, chicken, fish, like, their style of food was good. The, the chorizo, the bread, guava. You're not gonna hear me complain, I don't have relish. But yet still somehow, the only memorable thing I remember about Cuba Rage is relish in our burger. Uptown man, he's been living in his relish land. For those of you who are like, what are you talking about? When I went to Cuba, I was in line waiting for the buffet to open, and there was this old man, vacationer, who was re really raging. Ah, this is shit, I'm never coming back here. You know, the food is crap. Sure, they have a place where you can get like burgers. What are you looking at? <laughs> She's looking at me burgers all hours of the night, but they don't have any relish. I find it super hilarious that Chantal cannot remember anything that she said during Cuba Rage, guys. No, it's such a blur to me. I don't remember what I said. Did I say that? But yeah, can for some reason remember it word for word exactly what this random man said. <laughs> Raging at the... I mean, it's not funny that the guy, the alleged man that definitely exists, wink, wink, was, you know, raging at the uh, employees, which is never okay, but just... She could remember that fine, but like anything she said uh, during that live stream, oh my god, nope, don't remember that at all. Mm -mm. And I was hot and hangry, and I was like, just shut it. Like, you're in Cuba. You know? Anyway, it was annoying. I'm sure you can imagine. Like, there's so many other things you can eat. Like, you go to Cuba to eat a hamburger? I don't know. You know what I mean? Like, be, like try the food. You're like, Cuba, you beg. But I legit feel bad for you. It's spicy. How many of these a day I'm supposed to take? <laughs> Two a day. They taste like gummy candy though, so. <laughs> okay, guys. Um, I know I'm a very fast eater. When I'm really hungry, and I always wait like a while to. We were busy earlier, so. I'm gonna skip forward and see if there's anything. If not, I'll see you guys in a second. All right, well, that would be a no. But with that being said, though, <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching, and I guess we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.